Hey guys, what's up? Welcome back to my channel. It's your girl Francine or Franny. If you haven't already, go ahead and hit that subscribe button and subscribe to your girl so that we don't miss out on any videos from me. And hit that bell notification button so you'll be notified every single time that I upload. Alright, today's tutorial is not, um, I said tutorial, it's not a tutorial. In today's video, I will actually be doing a wig review. This is not the wig that I'm reviewing. I just wanted to throw some on really quick. <laughs> but, um, I'm... This unit is actually from whileafrican.com. I'll have a link down below if you guys are interested in this unit. And I also have a video up on how I customized and how the unit came. Um, this unit right here. I don't know if y'all can see that. This sensational, sensational instant fashion wig and Ina. It's Ina or Anna. I don't know. But yeah, this uh, fashion wig, color 1B. And this is, it's a synthetic wig. And girl, it was only like $16.99. <laughs> $16.99 plus like tax of course. But yeah, this wig was only $16.99. I seen a couple reviews on it and I was like, ooh, let me let me cop that. But yes, um, I'm gonna take it out of the bag and show you guys how it looks. Oh y'all, I'm trying out some new lashes. I don't know if I like them or not, but they really getting on my goddamn nerve. <laughs> Anyways, let me just go ahead and open this up and show you guys how the wig looks. All right, y'all, so it came in this, what is this called, like a net? I don't know, to protect the hair, I'm guessing. It came in this, and this is how it looks. Okay, so this is how the wig looks straight out of the packaging. It has like some loose curls, which I really, which I really like on hair. This is how the front looks. I guess it's considered as like a lace wig. I'm no, I'm not sure. It only has like this little piece of lace. This is how the part look. Part will be like plucking the part a little bit just to make it look a little bit more realistic. And this is how the inside looks. So y'all, so the inside doesn't have any clips. But it looks like it does have like it does have an adjustable strap, so I guess that's good. I probably end up sewing some clips inside of the wig, like I have in this. Well, I didn't sew any clips on in this one, but this particular wig has clips, and I need some. I'm a little nervous, y'all, because this wig already came like pre-plugged and it looked it very natural. This wig here doesn't look so natural, so. I don't know, we'll, we'll see, we'll see, we'll see. And the curls on this unit really don't look the same as, as the lady in the picture, which is fine with me. We don't like these curls anyways. Hers is kind of like feathered back, kind of. All right, y'all, so I'm just gonna go ahead and pop this wig on and show you guys how it looks straight out of the box without doing anything to it first. All right guys, so this is basically how the wig looks straight out of the box without doing anything to it. It is meant to be like a side part, so I did shift the wig a bit. Um, let me show you guys. I love the bang part. Um, this part here. This part here, the side of the wig, the right side of the wig, it's a little bit annoying, but it's still really pretty. I'm gonna show you the part of the wig. This is how it looks. And here's that little lace piece that I showed you guys as well that I'm gonna um, clip off. And I'm gonna show you guys where it hits on me because I am short, I'm only 5'1". And this wig is pretty long. I'm not really used to like long wigs. But it hits about... Bump 
below my boobs. I'll definitely say this wig is about 22, 24 inches. Probably about 22 inches, which I'm not used to it at all. I never wear like really long hair. But y'all, I am experiencing a little bit of shedding already, which um, which I expected anyways, because it's a synthetic wig and it was only $16.99, so. so. And a little bit of tangling, that's a little bit, not much, like not much at all. Oh well, yeah, straight out the pack, y'all. And I am going to play around with this wig. Oh y'all, let me show you the back of the wig. This how. Now I'm gonna show you. Like I mentioned before, y'all, it's a 1B. It's about 22 inches. Shipping took about like a week to come. Yeah, it took only probably like a week to come. Um, it was $16.99. Shipping was actually $12. So I don't know how you feel about spending $12. I mean, I think this wig is great. So it's definitely worth it. The total came up to probably what, like 28, 29 bucks or something like that for this wig plus the shipping, which is really good. Like, come on now, you, can, you can't need that. So I got this wig from from samsbeauty.com. I think that's it, yes, from samsbeauty.com. I have the link in the description bar. So if you guys want to purchase this wig, you can go straight to the link, straight to the link and pick it up. But this wig is not something I would like go out and wear every day. I think this wig is more like a going out type of wig. But um, if that's you and if you end up, if you're like into like being like very glammed up, very glammed up on a daily basis, then hey, go for it, but this is just more like a going out wig for me. No, but I do, I absolutely love this wig. It's beautiful, the shine is beautiful, minimal shedding, especially for the price point. Like, come on now, you can't beat $16.99. But like I said, I'm gonna go ahead and like widen the part a little bit, and then I'll be right back and show you guys basically how I just kind of styled the wig to my liking a little bit. So I plucked the part a little bit and of course I had to make, you know, my artificial little baby hairs. <laughs> so, but yeah, this is basically how it came out. And this is how the part looks now. You can tell it looks a little bit more realistic, right? Uh, I plucked it a little bit and I add a little bit of concealer. And like I said, I made my little baby hairs. I would love to grow my own hair out to this length. It's possible, okay? It's possible. <laughs> if you didn't know, I am natural, so I don't have a relaxer or anything. So these wigs definitely come in handy as a protective style. I would definitely recommend wearing wigs if you are natural, because it definitely protects your hair. I definitely recommend this wig. I give this wig a nine out of 10 stars only because the shedding and um, it didn't have combs. Like, what wig doesn't come with a comb? Like, um, what is wig? It's beauty or whoever made this wig in a in a fashion couture wigs. I don't know who made this wig, but y'all need to make these. Y'all need to put some combs in y'all wigs, or y'all would have got a ten stars. But other than that, I absolutely love, love, love this wig. Yeah, if you guys are interested in this wig, like I said, the links will be down below. All the information will be linked down below. And if you like this video, please give me a thumbs up, comment, and subscribe, and share this video as well. Always, thank you guys so much for watching me, tuning it in every week. And until next time, peace. Fighting the truth, trying to hide, but I think it's alright.